the Samaritan who wouldn't see someone just lie bleeding and, and suffering by the side of the road without helping him, whatever motive he had, he can't have been a Christian because it's the alleged Jesus of Nazareth telling the story about someone who existed before he did. And the only people in the story who were told about who didn't do anything for the victim are the priests and the Levites. So what the story tells us, this parable, is you don't need religion to behave with ordinary decency and morality. And anyone who says you do says that you need dictatorial permission to do the right thing. I don't want someone bleeding to death from AIDS on my doorstep. For, not just for their sake, for mine I don't want that. Um, Oscar Wilde in The Soul of Man Under Socialism puts it very beautifully. He says, socialism would free us from the awful necessity of living for others. Uh, George Bernard Shaw, when he ran for office in London, said there should be no more houses built for the working classes without baths. And, and it was objected to him by the Tories and the Conservatives. Why give them baths? The poor are so ignorant and stupid, they won't even know how to use them. Uh, they'll keep coal in them. Uh, they don't deserve baths. You're wasting your compassion on them. He said, I don't want them to have a bath for their sake. I want them to have a bath for my sake. <laughs> That's the right mix of self-interest and morality.